assistance of the Templars. It is well done. And I pray this Inquisition fares better than the Chantry in its handling of magic. You disapprove of something the Chantry did? Are you allowed to do that? That largely depends upon one's company. While surrounded by those declared heretics already, I am safe enough. In some ways, Andraste had the simpler task. Magic should serve man, and not rule over him. That tells us what should be, but it does not tell us how to get there. So many times the methods of men have undone the spirit of their goals. Once you have sealed the breach, we shall see whether this Inquisition is truer to the Chantry, or its own namesake. Farewell. Make her go with you. The Templars will be an asset to this Inquisition. It's a shame we couldn't also get the mages on our side. I'll leave you to your work. So, the Templars joined the Inquisition. Even with Cullen here, I never thought that would happen. Of course, after Kirkwall, I never thought anyone would use Red Lyrium on purpose, either. The Templars should know better than anyone what that shit does to people. Finding more of it really punches a hole in my red lyrium at the temple was a coincidence theory. I'd like to keep hoping it's a coincidence, if you don't mind. I need to be able to sleep at night. Honestly, I, I think I'll give up sleeping for the foreseeable future. I've got people trying to find out where the red stuff came from. I think maybe we should make that a priority. But th that's enough doom and gloom. You just won a big victory for the Inquisition. What are you going to do to celebrate? That's a good point. We should celebrate. A banquet. Something like a banquet. A word to Josephine, and I bet she could arrange anything. Things should be calm around here for at least the next hour. Take a moment to enjoy it. If the world's about to end, I'm sure the Seeker will let us know. <laughs>